Hello. Please hit like button and subscribe my channel. Also press bell icon for future video notifications. Thanks. For car enthusiasts who also love fast jets, this could be the collaboration you've been dreaming of. McLaren Automotive is already known for building some of the fastest cars on the planet. Now, the UK company is teaming up with Lockheed Martin Skunk Works to suss out new ways of designing supercars of the future. Anyone with a modicum of aviation knowledge needs no introduction to the Skunk Works. For others, you've likely heard of the F-22 Raptor, F-35 Lightning II, F-117 Stealth Fighter, U-2 Spy Plane, or the State Route 71 Blackbird. If those aircraft names and designations are still a tad fuzzy, you might recognize the sleek jet in the photo gallery below, posing with a new McLaren Artura. The focus of this partnership is to morph the aerospace company's design software into something that can be applied to supercars, with an eye toward high-speed automotive systems. McLaren is a pioneering company that has always pushed boundaries and sought out new innovative and disruptive solutions to making the ultimate supercars, said McLaren Chief Technical Officer Darren Goddard. We hope this is the start of a longer and deeper collaboration that will benefit our customers in the long term. Of course, McLaren is no stranger to speed records. In 1998 eight years after the State Route 71 Blackbird was retired from service, Andy Wallace drove the McLaren F1 to an average top speed of 240. One mile per hour. It exceeded the F1's previous mark of 231 miles per hour to become the world's fastest production car. A record that stood for several years until the Bugatti Veyron's 253.8 mph run in 2005. Thanks for watching. Credits to www.motor1.com and Spied Build LLC. Please subscribe my channel for more auto updates.